Once upon a time in the quaint, vibrant village of Viberville, there lived a boy named Jake. Jake was an adventurous boy. Always ready for an exciting venture. One day, he decided to organize a picnic with his friends, Matt, Rose, and Grace. The friends agreed on a spot by the river in the forest. They divided the tasks. Jake would bring the sandwiches. Matt would bring the drinks. Rose would bring the fruits. And Grace would bring the desserts. The next day, they were all excited and prepared for their picnic. When Jake reached into his bag to get the sandwiches, he was astonished to find socks instead. It turned out that he had accidentally taken his sock drawer instead of the lunchbox. His friends laughed until their bellies ached. Next, it was Matt's turn. He opened his cooler, but instead of juice boxes, it was filled with his dad's shaving cream. Matt's face turned as red as a sunburned strawberry, and the others couldn't control their laughter. Then, Rose took out her bag, but instead of juicy apples and oranges, there were tennis balls. Rose was puzzled and then realized she had used her sports bag instead of the grocery bag. Everyone was rolling on the grass, laughing uncontrollably. Finally, Grace decided to save the day. She opened her box with a grand gesture. Expecting to see chocolate cakes and cupcakes. However, she found her little sister's toy tea set in there. Grace shrieked with surprise and everyone else was laughing so hard. Tears streamed down their cheeks. They laughed and laughed and soon realized that while they didn't have a traditional picnic, they had the most whimsical wilderness feast ever. Instead of getting upset, they used socks for a tablecloth, shaving cream for fun foam fights, played catch with tennis balls, and had a pretend tea party with the toy set. And from that day onwards, every time they remembered the whimsical wilderness feast, they laughed and their day became brighter. They learned that sometimes, things might not go as planned. But with good friends and a funny mistake, any day could be a remarkable day. And, of course, they also learned to double check their bags before a picnic. <laughs>